Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got a system of exponential equations. The very first equation is 9 power x equals to 11. And the second equation is 11 power y equals to 6. And now we are going to find the value of log of 2 with the base 3 in terms of x and y variables. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Let's go ahead and get started with the solution. And here's our very first step. Let's focus on this uh, log of 2 with the base 3. And here I have copied it down. And now let's recall the change of base formula. So we are going to apply this rule on log of 2 with the base 3. So this could be written as log of 2 in the numerator and at the denominators is going to be log of 2. Three. So let me go ahead and call this equation as equation number 1. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this very first equation, 9 power x equals to 11. And here I have copied it down. And now let's go ahead and take the log on both sides. So I can take log on 9 power x equals to log of 11. And now let's recall this power rule. According to this rule, this uh, exponent x, we can take it to the front. So therefore, we can write this one as x times log of 9 equals to log of 11. And now let's focus on this 9. 9 could be written as 3 power 2. So therefore, I can write x times log of 3 square equals to log of 11 on the right hand side. Now let's go ahead and apply this power rule once again. According to this rule, we are going to move this exponent all the way to the front. So therefore, I can write this thing as 2 times x log of 3 equals to log of 11. Now let's go ahead and divide both sides by 2x on this side and 2x on this side. This 2x and 2x is gone. So we can simply write log of 3 equals to 1 over 2x times log of 11. 11. Let me go ahead and call this equation as equation number 2. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this next equation. And here I have copied it down. And now let's go ahead and take the log on both sides of this equation. So we can write log of 11 power y equals to log of 6. And now let's recall this power rule according to this rule we can move this exponent y all the way to the front. So therefore, we can write this one as y times log of 11 equals to log of 6. And now let's focus on this argument 6. 6 could be written as 2 times 3. So therefore, our this equation could be written as y times log of 11 on the left hand side is going to stay same and on the right hand side this is going to become log of 2 and then times 3 and now let's recall this product rule according to this rule this log of 2 times 3 could be written as log of 2 plus log of 3 so therefore on the right hand side this could be written as log of 2 plus log of 3 and the left hand side is going to stay same y times log of 11 but we know that the log of 3 equals to 1 over 2 x times log of 11 so therefore I am going to replace this log of 3 by this so therefore our this equation is going to become y times log of 11 is going to stay same on the left hand side equals to log of 2 plus log of 3 I'm going to replace it by this 
So this is going to be 1 over 2x times log of 11. Now let's go ahead and move this part on the left hand side. So we are going to have y times log of 11 and then minus 1 over 2x times log of 11 and we ended up only with the log of 2 on the right hand side. And now we can see that log of 11 and log of 11 is in common. So we can factor that one out. So let me go ahead and put down log of 2 first on the left hand side. And here I can factor out log of 11. So we're going to have a y minus 1 over 2x in the parentheses times log of 11. And now let's focus on this part only y minus 1 over 2x. And here I have copied it down y minus 1 over 2x. Let's go ahead and crisscross. So we are going to cross multiply. So this is going to give us 2xy minus the other way around 1 times 1 is 1 divided by this on the denominator 1 times 2x. We are going to multiply them out that is going to be 2x power this equation is going to simply become log of 2 on the left hand side and I am going to replace this one by this fraction so I can write 2xy minus 1 divided by 2x times log of 11. Now let me go ahead and call this equation as equation number 3. And here's our final step. Let's go ahead and solve for this uh, log of 2 with the base 3. And we know our log of uh, 2 with the base 3 equals to log of 2 divided by log of 3. That is our equation 1. And here I have copied down our equation 1. Now we can see this log of 2 we are going to replace it by this uh, whatever on the right hand side in equation 3 and likewise log of 3. I am going to replace uh, this log of 3 by this right hand side in equation 2. So therefore our this log of 2 with the base uh, 3 is going to be equal to 2xy minus 1 divided by 2x times log of 11 and for log of 3 we're going to replace this equation 2 right hand side which is 1 over 2x times log of 11. See this log of 11 and this log of 11 is gone. This 1 over 2x and this 2x is gone as well. So we ended up with simply log of 2 with a base 3 turns out to be 2xy minus 1 as a answer. Thus our log of 2 with a base 3 turns out to be equal to 2 times xy minus 1. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.